bringing in again, kitties. Crank Cody here, and welcome back to Rust. I'm just getting all this sorted out. Um, now, I'm not exactly sure. Um, I'm not exactly sure about a lot of stuff. But what I do know is that we're gearing up to go take back my neighbor's old house. And the people who took his house, apparently, are talking smack. Um, so they're all trying to re-gear. And in the last episode, I was the bad guy. I actually, sadly, took this. I broke into this guy's house and I took his stuff. And But luckily he had a research kit on him. And I researched um, a satchel charge, but I didn't research the explosives because I don't have explosives. I, I for completely forgot about the explosives. I was so excited to research a satchel charge or an explosive charge that I didn't research the fundamental crafted crafting item to that. As you can see, my house is pretty tall. Oh, I have all this food, too. Oh, well. You know what? I'll store some of it in here. So if you break in my house on the bottom floor, there's food in this bottom, <laughs> bottom area. You thieves. I guess that'd be karma. And all there is in this is just stones and uh, animal fat. Okay, I'm gonna go back out. I'm gonna go see if I can get some zombies. Kill some zombies. See if there's another uh, research kit I can get. Then I can research some metal stuff, or maybe my M4. Or leather. You know, there's a lot of stuff you can research. Oh, yeah, headshot. When it makes that sound, it's headshot. Ah, I missed. zombies in the immediate area. I don't want to really go far for zombies. If they're, if they're just in this field, I'll go get them. But usually they're on those rocks over there. And I really don't want to stray too far away just to get some zombies at the moment. As you can see, my house is uh, getting up there. Pretty tall. And, um... Oh, I swear that was a rock there. I thought those branches are the same color. Oh, there's a rock. Um, I always go for wood first, though, because I need wood compared to the luxury of uh, ore. And I don't need stones, but I keep them anyway. You never know when I'll need to make, uh, I guess, arrows or another furnace. I keep everything. I don't really like to waste anything unless it's a rock. Like the hand rock. Now those I will throw away because who needs a hand rock? Oh, something just popped up over there, and I'm gonna go check it out. I'm gonna go see if anyone's home. I, it looks like several shacks back there. After uh, I'm gonna screw that. Yeah, screw that. Oh, sleeper. can't break down that metal one. Actually, you can. It just takes a long time. You have to hit all the sides. So first I'm going to go see what he has in here. I'm sorry, guy. I'm not... I don't want to be a bad guy, but... I... <laughs> Hello? Is that to me? If it is, just tell me and I'll stop hitting this door. I'm just doing that to make sure that whoever that Clint guy is... Up where? I can't tell if you're talking to me or not. I can't tell this time. Okay, no. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I'm in. I feel like a total douchebag, but you know what? It's survival of the fittest. I'll take all his cloth. Do I really want his cloth? I know I'll take his no, I want his chicken. I'm not gonna take his cloth. Somebody else can come by and grab that, but I don't really don't want cloth. Oh my goodness. Guys. We hit a mother load. Good, I need that ammo too. Take some charcoal. Oh! Read it. Read it. Did you guys see that? Planks I need. Take more chicken. Paper, yes. Anything in there? No? Okay, I can take the cloth. That. I'll go ahead and take the shells. Ah, anything else? I'll take his bow. This was a pretty successful raid, if I don't if I don't say so myself, guys. And yes, I do feel bad. But he was enroaching on my in He was on my territory. Guy, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I feel like a bad guy. Because this is the second of the small houses I've done. But I need this stuff. I don't even know where people are finding all these research kits. Just... You go in there. Um, also, you can go in there, because I don't really need ya. I don't really need these things, and, but I'll throw them in there anyway. Hello? Someone on the turf, and I gotta stash this stuff as fast as I can. Who is is that? You, Clint, or is this Rogue? I think it's Clint. Is there something you need? Are you all in here? Never! Maybe, hold on. I'm not really gonna let him in. Where'd I put my paper at? He's definitely probably not. I think I put it in the, uh, in here. I'm trying to figure out where I put my paper. Oh, hey, okay. If you, if you want some easy stuff, go, if you're standing in front of my house, turn around and go straight towards the mountain. Like going away from my house, and there's a couple huts up there that are open, and I left some loot. There's like some bow and arrows, I think. There's there's full cloth, um, some hatchets, stuff like that. Yeah, and there's there's a couple huts out there that ha are just full of stuff <laughs> that I stole. Once again, I am sorry to its previous owners. Done cooking already? Leave anything in there? I have wood in there. Take you. Where to put the paper? I didn't put it under stairs, I don't think. Ah, oh, here you are. Um. I know what I need to research. I don't know why the light goes out when I do that. Ah, 
I think I'm gonna cut this one here. So, thank you for watching, and <laughs> I'm sure I'll be raiding a house again in the next episode. I just feel so bad about raiding small houses. So, thank you.